people people so i don't know why i'm back on this platform again but i am back uh, those of you that have been following me you're probably tired by now but if it's your first time watching in hi hi beautiful people my name is irene and um I think I'm gonna do this like a weekly vlog just take you into a few days into my week and then we'll see how it unfolds I don't have anything specific planned um, I just know I want to be on camera because I miss being on camera I miss talking a lot and just rambling about things that you know so uh, quick background uh, I'm from Namibia I'm currently in China I am an architecture major student currently doing my second year of masters so I don't have classes and uh, in China, it's holiday right now. It's um, end of January. So holiday starts now and then goes through February. So around March, that's when school will resume. So right now, I have a lot of free time on my hands. So I figured, why not do this? Why not try this again? I'm not sure if I'll be consistent or not, but uh, we'll just go with it. I just did my hair. I've decided I'm giving braids a break, like extensions. And I'm not a, a wigs girly, definitely not that. So I've just been doing a lot of like um, protective styles with my own hair. I do have 4C hair. So um, yeah, my girl Preshi, she hooked me up. I will put her contact down below. A lot of the times when I do my hair, usually when it's braids, people ask who did your hair, who did your hair? So it's Preshi. Um, I will put her, her widget ID down below her Instagram contact. All, all that stuff. I'll put it in there and then if you're in Xi'an, you can hit her up and um, She's one of the best y'all. She is one of the best. So so it's a Monday. It's currently seven minutes to two I did not plan on going to the gym, but I'm thinking I will so i um, gonna get in the shower Do a little bit of skincare eat something go to the gym and then I have something else to do in the evening. So um Yeah, I'll see you guys later Bye. So I made some avocado toast and some salmon with boiled eggs on the side and then some Greek yogurt plain Greek yogurt with the chia seeds this is my first meal I just got to the gym and it is 4.06 I have less than 40 minutes to get through this workout I already have it planned out but then obviously because there are other people I may not get to do what I want, so I'll just um, improvise and do what I can. We're doing back today. We're training back. So I'll try and keep it to a minimum of four to five exercises if I can. Yeah. <laughs> 
so it's exactly 4.58 and I'm done with my workout so just gotta change and then um, head to my next appointment I need to have lunch I need to eat something I think I'll order something on my way I'm not quite sure but I'm still full from the meal that I had earlier so I'm good to go for like another hour but just because I worked out I want to eat something ideally high protein so I'll grab something I'll grab something so today it is Wednesday I think I started this vlog on a Monday I didn't vlog yesterday my cycle started I wasn't feeling that well so I was just like eh I don't want to do anything I didn't want to do anything today either but I've been home all day and I listen if you know me there's one thing to know about me is I do not like to be home absolutely not so I'm thinking I want to go take a walk but the weather isn't that good however I'm gonna risk it I'm just gonna risk it because I will go crazy if I sit in this house all day long so I need to take a walk uh, I'm about I already had like a meal early on in the day but I want to have a protein uh, a protein shake real quick then I'm just gonna clean up my kitchen a little bit because when I get back shower I will have to prep dinner and I don't like cooking when I have a messy kitchen so I want to just get it ready for when I get back uh, I'm gonna listen to a podcast I usually listen to Joel uh, pastor Joel I don't know if to call him a pastor or not but yeah I listen on Spotify so every time I'm in the kitchen or anywhere really walking whatever I'm doing I just listen to one of his podcasts it gets my soul nice and calm <laughs> so yeah um, I've watched most of them I think it, they upload like every single day so don't have a critical spirit not that I'll just play anything hi this is Joan Victoria thanks so much for listening to the podcast we have a new reason is none of that matters to God all the circumstances be against you the experts may tell you, you'll never get well, you'll never meet the right person, you'll never be successful. Every voice says you're stuck. Just accept it. No way in the natural. The good news is we serve a supernatural God. When he commands the blessing, all the forces of darkness cannot stop him. With the commanded blessing, you'll go places you couldn't go on your own. Doors will open that you couldn't open. You'll be promoted even though you weren't the most qualified. The commanded blessing will cause good breaks to find you. Contracts, opportunities, business, favor will track you down. Now get in agreement with God. Quit saying, I'll never get ahead, Joel. These people at work don't like me. It doesn't matter who doesn't like you at work. What matters is the Most High God that likes you. He is not limited by who's against you, by who's not getting you credit, who's not treating you right. One touch of His key. People don't have the final say. God does. People don't determine your destiny. They didn't breathe life into you. They didn't call you. They didn't number your days. You may be in a situation that feels unfair, seems like somebody's stopping you. Don't worry, your time is coming. Keep doing the right thing when the wrong thing is happening. There is a commanded blessing on your life. They can't keep you down. All the circumstances may be against you, but the Most High God is for you. Numbers chapter 22. If He can convince you to go around discouraged, thinking you've reached your limits, that will keep you. On days that it's actually nice and sunny I usually do my walks in this place 
I have a feeling they're making it a park or some kind of public area. So for now it's just like sand and a hill up there. So a lot of people do take their walks up there. One of these days I'll probably go on there hopefully. But it is getting colder now so I highly doubt it. So I'm done with my walk and um, I was walking back home. I figured I'm gonna do like a foot massage, foot cleaning thing. So I stopped here and I'm about to do that now. There's a tea bag in there. Ooh, this is hot. Oh, it's hot. Listen, the water is extremely hot. I picked the very first option which is 38 for 35 minutes. Uh, that's a horse. So the tea bag they put inside it's some kind of medicine actually. <音><音><音> God, I had a bone crack. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I was gonna wait till I do my nails again to take off the nail polish but he offered so he's doing it and it feels nice so much better than the machine that they used to take off the nail polish so if my feet are done I may I may actually hold off before I redo my hands Shinsan, Yeah. Yeah. Uh, then I said, yeah, I said, I think it's a good thing. 
Carry my own, do my own tea. <laughs> I want to do it for you. I will teach you. Famous South Indian dish. This is the. Um, yeah, it's it's called dosa. Dosa. Yeah. What's inside? Gloves, please. Yeah, dosa. Uh, onion, mashed potatoes, salad. And this is Indian tacos. <laughs> Tacos. <laughs> this Indian tacos, okay? It's like you, have, you have to taste like mini burgers. <laughs> yeah? Those are street food. This and this. And this. It's like something you serve as a starter. It's like mini snack. Oh. Say hi to my vlog. Hi. You'll now be in both. The last video I posted, you were in it, and I also in this one. <laughs> I think you are the secret to my YouTube. Because every time I want to post, you show up. <laughs> See how pretty. Oh God. No, you guys are gonna like have more, different taste. This one yeah. has more like jollof egg fried rice. Egg jollof fried rice. <laughs> it's a thousand of the pages. No, I'll leave it to go in. Sorry, my egg fried rice is here now. I don't care. Yeah. What you do. you, you no. Then you should take, mm. you should take one uh, lamb with it. Help you. Thanks, girl. So shortly after that lunch date, we went on with the rest of our errands for the day. And this is the following day at one of another restaurants. Most people call it Mojar. Some pronounce it Mohar, whichever one it is. Um, we just got some food. I think this was my first time trying it. He said it's uh, enchiladas. Yeah, that one. Uh, got some tacos and some tuna salad. I think it came with some guacamole. That tasted actually pretty good. I think I may try that next time. Other than that, yeah, we didn't really get much drinks. We were just there for dinner, and we headed out shortly after that. Oh, and then I also had the, um, what is it? The quesadillas, the chicken quesadillas. I love those. I always get those every time I go there. So um, that's that, and we enjoyed dinner, and I'll, we headed back home. Not much happened that day, really. So I just got back home and it has been a crazy busy day. Um, 
I think this vlog is coming to an end now. It's probably been a week. Um, I didn't vlog as much as I wanted to just because the weather got really bad and it's like snowing everywhere. It's freezing. There are no cabs on the road. Places are closed. So plans got canceled and all that. Anyways, um, this was lovely. I actually, I forgot how much I missed filming and doing this guy, like doing this with you guys. So I'm hoping I can take you on. So right now I have to pack. It's, it's Monday evening. I have to pack because tomorrow I'm going on a trip on like a quick trip for like two to three days. So I have to pack because our train is like early in the morning around eight, but I have to be up at 530. So have not packed a single thing. Anyways, um, I think I'll start that vlog now. So by the time the, the traveling vlog goes up, this would have already been up. So thank you guys for tuning in and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.